Is it a dollar for this? Yeah. Uh, TikTok or what do you usually do? YouTube. Okay. Yeah. What's your channel? Uh, the Traveling Picker, Pat D's. Yep. I don't like TikTok. No? No. Does it, did you ever try it? Uh, I don't like the, the stuff that they push on there. Oh, okay. Yeah, but I, I've been doing it. A beautiful Sunday. It's time to hit the flea market, folks. We got my GoPro. Busy, busy place. Oh, we need cash. So let me show you a view from my point, and I hope you like this video. Okay, folks, uh, welcome to the video. I really appreciate your support. My name is Pat Dees. I am the traveling picker. I make a living selling stuff online. Uh, eBay and Amazon are my two primary, but I've even started selling on whatnot. I actually even have done this flea market that I'm currently at right now. Um, I went there with a mission this Sunday to see if I can buy stuff to flip. And um, so I'm going to do a little bit of voiceover. I'm going to let you guys watch from my point of view. Now, it's always tough chopping down two hours. I basically was there for two hours and cutting it down to a reasonable amount of time. So I am going to be working on that. And uh, I'll give you guys some perspective and some voiceover on why I bought something. And, um, you know, I, I, I went there not necessarily to be picky, but not also uh, waste cash. As I approached this vendor, I noticed the variety that he had, and I really like variety. Uh, I, if you listen to him, how respectful, and, and you know that'll be five dollars, sir. Everything was, sir. Five dollars, please. Thank you. $5. Certain very... You know, I think $5 would be smaller ones too. And this bigger one. Each. I think there might be a couple more laying around. I think everything was $5, sir. $5, thank you. I did look these up a couple minutes as I walked away, and honestly, there was a bunch of them sold, but right around that $5 plus shipping, so there wasn't really much room to make money. I had just been at the flea market, honestly, here probably about 10 minutes, and I really wanted to save my money for some better deals. Wow, here comes the first purchase that I'm going to do for the day, Legos. Legos always sell, especially new in the box, if you can get them at the right price. I wanted to make sure I wasn't stepping on the guy and his, his son's toes. Uh, they, if they mentioned Legos, I wasn't going to interfere with their sale. They were getting those... Um, those toy balls. sitting in the, his childhood playing with those. They are amazing. I'm 50 and I still play with Those puzzle balls are awesome. Then you know that they're, that's a really good price and you will play with them. You can just throw the flowers on the table. You can have the stand with it. You want the stand? And you will enjoy that. Sorry about my hand there blocking the camera. I really wasn't paying attention to my chest mount. I, I, I tilted it. I didn't even check it and I just hit the power button. How much is this one? Um, um, oh, it's awesome. I looked up the first two, and is it this one's ten dollars. Uh, you can if you're doing the three of them, you can have them for eight. Eight each. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Enjoy. Yeah, we will. Twenty-four. 
Did you do 22? Just two dollars, just two dollars off. Yeah, well. So there you go, my first purchase. Basically, twenty-two dollars. And as I'm filming this now in post-edit, they're actually worth more than I thought. I thought this was about a sixty dollar. It's actually closer to about a ninety to a hundred dollar um, worth. So this was uh, a home run. Thank you. Busy today, huh? How much is Andre the Giant? I'll go five on that. If you give me ten, I'll throw in the Han Solo. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I, I, yeah, I don't like Star Wars. I like wrestling. Yeah. yeah. He's cool. He's got the best and everything. He look close. Yeah. Dewey. Dewey's puppets. Busy today, huh? It's gonna get hot today. Yeah. I'll be walking back around. Yeah? Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, these original black and white photos caught my eye. Two friends of mine that sell on eBay don't really do YouTube, uh, but they sell a lot of vintage train related pictures or postcards or slides. And I'm like, well, you know what? Hey, you learn from them. And if, if it's right there and if the price is right, maybe I can pick these up. Just curious how much these are. Yeah, yeah. You want all three of them? Well, it depends. Seven bucks? I'll do it. I'm going to wrap them each. Yeah, I, I honestly okay. thought he was going to say about $10 each. And I was hoping he said $10 for all three. I was hoping, I was hoping you would have said, said 10 Well, look at that. Look at that. I know. I hate that sometimes. sometimes. You don't want to insult people, people, you know? You know? Yeah. 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 And a couple dollars a piece, honestly, to... Uh, what, 12? E even at five bucks a piece, that's 60 bucks. That's, to me, that's that's a good deal. Seven into 60. Yes, yes, your money. money. Thank you. Thank you, dear. If you like gals. Yeah, isn't that pretty cool? Yeah. Someone did a nice job with that. Yeah, it's, it's really awesome. Yeah. It's different. And there's another one over here too, the alphabet. Yeah, very simple but nice. I give you a hefty bag too, this way. Yeah, I appreciate that. I was I actually just walked up to my car because I had three other bags. Oh did you? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, you're all set. Have a great day. Yep, you Thank too. You Happy so Memorial much. Day. Thank you. you too. Um, I'm asking 50 on that. Well, these action figures from the same person I bought the photos were in great shape, and these are about 25 years old. Re realistically, as a collector, they're probably worth about 25 each. Uh, I didn't even ask. Uh, I have a lot of wrestlers, and he was. We got talking about them. I think they were trying to sell them as a set, but um, I was interested in the cards if they were reasonable, but. He was probably asking right about what they sell for. So that was a pass. Let me see. How 
How much is the box of cards? Box, I'm asking 30. Did they shut this for me? Yeah. I it was 89 is the one you want. Yeah. Yeah. I like a dumbass. <laughs> it was ridiculous. I ripped them. Yeah. I had three boxes of them. I ripped them all open. Yeah. This, Twenty years ago. This. These aren't the match, but I. No. It's, yeah. just, it's a full 36 packs, but it's that I'm asking 25. Wait, for. Yeah. This guy. How much? That one, two bucks. Boy, someone kept these in good shape. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're, we're back in. <laughs> Yeah, until we put them out like here in the sun. They're, they're like, actually like one of our kids. Yeah, yeah but they're they're like 20, 25 years old. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, because yeah, I, I collect those. I have those. We actually, I won't break them up. I'm selling them as two sets. Yeah. Like, it's a complete you know what set. I mean? This yeah. way. Yeah. The two per pieces, babe. Ten bucks? For both of them? Yeah. Thank you. Sorry. Oh. Oh, Pokemon. Uh, yeah, please. Yeah, this guy had a lot of Pokemon brand new stuff and new cards. And I never got into Pokemon or neither did my kid. Maybe they got a couple packs back in the day, but I wouldn't know the first really how to value those and um, it's hard to educate yourself on everything so you know obviously I don't get into them unless they're super cheap and I feel like I can flip them for a profit. Uh, Ma'am, this is five dollars. Yeah. Could you do better? How much do you want to give me? Let's take a dollar off. That sounds good. Oh. <laughs> well, you're happy and I'm happy. <laughs> you got change? Yeah. Thank you. You have a good weekend.
He's asking about five dollars just for the empty case. I looked him up. The, the games weren't even going. Some games were going like five to eight dollars. So just wasn't no, no, wasn't worth it. <laughs> Okay. So this was the couple that I set up to Nick uh, last time when I was selling, and um, I've seen them when I bought storage units in the past. Yeah, they actually were uh, about three years ago. I filmed the unit about the motorcycles, and that was their unit. I'm going to have to edit a little bit of this out because he had an interesting story for me. And uh, I'll yeah, kind of nice. talk about it. Yeah, you, you guys, guys left, left the week, week the last, last time, time I was, I was here. here. I was next door. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. you guys left the week after. She told me. Still buying units? Uh, I haven't bought none this year yet. I've been buying stuff by the pallet. So you know, up at the at the warehouse. Being able to cash those in because of the the social security numbers tied to them. Okay, yeah, I wanted to edit some of that out. He kind of got yeah. real close to that. Yeah, I would go. I was a great Google and Google it, but I, I wouldn't think so. Basically, he told me. Isn't it amazing you know, how somebody will, like like how many times does that happen? Savings bonds, and he kind of felt like he should be able to cash them in because he found them in the asset document. Yeah. yeah. I said, I said, don't tell I got it. I got it. Yeah. 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 Be turned over to the family, and that was my opinion. How much you asking for the VHS? Two bucks. So, just so you know, it was in your thing. Oh, oh. Wow, is there any other way to do it? Yeah. <laughs> how, much, how much is this rabbit? You want that in that for ten bucks? Oh, Lego rabbit. Yeah. Oh, and is that moving? <laughs> I should have bought the rabbit. <laughs> it was worth about twenty-five bucks. I just didn't didn't look it up. Um, and sometimes I've seen things like cheap Lego sets. Uh, like he uh, was probably right on, but I was off. Lunchbox, Pat D's alert, lunchbox, 90210. It, it was a plastic one and uh, the label had a ripple in it, so I didn't even entertain it. Is that, is that your stuff here on the mat, too? Huh? Huh? He had noticed my camera. Looking back now, I noticed that, but at the time, I didn't notice. <laughs> The lady there had his attention, so that's why I didn't say nothing. <laughs> do do a dollar for this? Yeah, yeah. YouTube. Yeah. Uh, the traveling picture of Pat Yep. Yep. I don't like, I don't like TikTok. TikTok. Yeah. Nice, no, nice kid. I'd say in his young uh, twice. I don't like the stuff, <laughs> the stuff that, that they push on there. On there. Oh. Yeah, but yeah, I've been, been doing it for like four years. And I... The traveling picker, Patsy's, like Christie's, like yeah. So, uh, so I, 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 sell I sell here too. Here too. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 <laughs> What's, your What's your name? Paul. Paul. I'm Patrick. Nice to meet you. Have a good day. Yep. Yeah. 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 
Card are for me mostly. I like baseball cards. I don't know if anybody follows me. Just and, check, uh, checking you see if you have baseball. baseball. I'm just looking at what he had, and uh, he had mentioned he had some others. And I wasn't he baseball, didn't, baseball, and then all of a sudden he went to his truck and he brought yeah, them out. Well, I, I started looking at yeah. yeah. like, like how old? old. Oh, yeah. 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 Sometimes the problem I notice with the flea market is people do their their research. They kind of want to sell things at what the full retail is on eBay. Yeah, they keep those in there so no one steals them. Yeah. I don't blame you. Can I look through them? Yeah. All right. He had some good cards here, actually. I just wasn't in the um, the mode to really. Joe Pippetta. Um, pay did, that did kind of money. Did you collect, or you just, just came across these? I, I collect them. Yeah. Don Larson, I have an autograph ball of his. Yeah, some 60s. Joe Pepitone again. What are you asking for that one? 40. Yeah, I don't even know what it's worth. <laughs> yeah. So uh, let me let me look, and then uh, I'm gonna be here for a little while. All right. What's your name? Joe. Joe. I'm Patrick. Right. Nice to meet you. Hey, hey, hey. Yep.
What are you asking? Maybe if the right, if the price is right. Yeah, I probably gotta get ten bucks in the whole box. Let's go over this one. Yeah, that's a nice. Oh, that's all the Yeah, that's where I live. Well, hey, you know what? He wanted ten bucks for. There was probably about seven or eight things in there. I thought honestly, if I could sell the Arctic Cat. Operator's manual that, um, not big money, easy to ship, but you know, you, you put them in a filing cat cabinet and, um, they're all right. And, you know, at the end of the day, you know, you're supporting other people that are reselling too. And as I just looked up this 1978 uh, Arctic cat, they go for about 12, 15 bucks. So, right there, I was, I was spot on basically what I would get for it. So, that's all right. You know what I mean? Um, if every sometimes you get a box like that, and ten dollars could easily turn into fifty bucks. Painted, painted. I got this, but I don't know. Oh shit, that's ripped. I forgot my bag. Yeah. I got this big bag. That's all right. I strapped the supplies to you, that way when they tip over you can throw them. Yeah, I don't know, yeah, it's probably worth something. Well, I'll give you this, bud. Get the shit out of here, I don't want to sit here. There's a couple books in here, too. Oh, yeah. 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 I'll throw that in, but for ten bucks, yeah. All right. Well, sorry, I, just, I took ornaments out of it. Okay, we'll see you next week. Yeah. All right, but we got the Legos. Yeah. Not put together? Are they put together? Or? No, no, new in the box. Uh, 60 bucks. Thank good you. Deal. Thank you. Have a good day. This was probably my um, fun purchase of the day. You know, it's funny as I'm editing this video is you'll pick up on conversations, and this is where people don't realize you record two hours, you're trying to get a 30-minute video, and you're spending five or six hours editing the beat-up wrestlers. Most of them are around five. Some of the better ones. I have some better ones at the end of the table there, closer to eight to ten. Yeah, yeah. 
Could beat up ones, you know, I could do five or maybe three for ten. He's a little better. King Kong. Yeah, King Kong. King Kong. Monday. Just the place, yeah? Okay. <clears throat> Five bucks. Would you do four for ten? Four for ten? Uh, which ones? Uh, which ones? I'm gonna get I'm right gonna here. These two. These two. These two. Um, um, they're all beat up. Yeah, I can make. Yeah, that I can work. make. That all, right. Right. all right. So what I have to do is clean them and paint them. Do you have a bag, boss? Yeah. I'm actually hoping in the future. I've seen people do this, where they clean them and paint them. And do repaintings? No, but, no, you know, but, you it'd, know be it'd be a good project. project. It would be a great project. I, I, was, I always thought that'd be fun to do myself. A good winter project. Yeah. 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 I'm at 10 I'm with at you. 10 with you. Yes, you are. Yep. Yep. I'm not going, I'm not nowhere. going nowhere. nowhere. He had mentioned that he had some other ones at the end of the table, so I was going to go down there and see. He had some. I, I Actually, this guy was very nice. I liked his table. I liked his setup and uh, the variety he had. I could see buying more stuff from him in the future. Those wrestlers, that was a good deal. I mean, two fifty a piece. Honestly, probably worth about eight or ten dollars a piece. Uh, cleaned and painted, they'd be worth about twenty five on average. I made down sure the arms weren't chewed up. Here was the box of the better ones. I love I love wrestling, and um, I. I this was one of the first, some of these I got as a kid. I'm really kind of huffing and puffing here. <laughs> as, as the day was about 83, and I've been walking around for about an hour and a half at this point. So I'm going to get that Captain Lou Albano. I don't have him, so that one is, is going to, I'm going to keep myself. And Andre the Giant so much, is always a favorite. Uh, uh, which one is well, I owe you well, 10 right now. Yes. Yes. So how about so we do, how about two, we do two, two of these two for 10? For 10? Two Since two we did four, four for 10 down there. Down these, down are, these are better. 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 I can do it. I can do it. All right. So I owe you 20. I owe you 20. All right. All right. I'm going to take these two. Take these two. <laughs> I might make... I like wrestling and I do uh, YouTube. I might make a video out of restoring oh, these. Cool. Cool. Very cool. Well, I'm here every week. If you end up What's doing that, let me know. Mick. Mick Patrick. I, I come to, I've been, yeah. I, I was here a couple weeks ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I, I come and sell things Good. sometimes too, yeah. But I love uh, toys and collectible stuff, so. Awesome. Well, thank you very much. I appreciate it. All right, thanks, buddy. I'll see you again. Enjoy them, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Well, that's it, folks. I do appreciate you guys being here. Um, I spent about $60, $70, honestly, uh, just in the Legos alone, about $90 to $100. The, the photos, another $60. Uh, and the wrestlers, you know, honestly, if I paint those, that this easily, uh, $60, $70, $250, $300 uh, potential uh, you know, sales. That's not pure profit, obviously, if I sell, you know, you got, you got your... You know, depending upon if you charge for shipping and fees like that. So, it was very busy at this place. This is at a drive-in uh, movie theater in uh, Dixon City, Pennsylvania, near Scranton, Pennsylvania. And um, I did I did walk every lane. I did notice that there was some some people there. I was there was probably about maybe five to ten people selling things, and it just seemed like they pulled up with their car and, and they sort of brought junk from home that you know to, to, to be there twenty twenty five dollars and you know there there are probably people that go there on the weekend and hope to uh, sell you know a hundred dollars hundred fifty dollars worth of stuff and, and make a hundred dollars for being there for you know four to six hours however long that they are when I set up there I, I, I want to maximize my time so I really try to bring a, a good mix of new and new stuff, and um, you can tell the people that are there all the time. They're organized. They're set up. They, they, they got a great, you know, mm. they know they know what they're doing. Yeah, these these were cool. These were these old um, popcorn plastic decorations. So guys, I hope you liked this video. Greatly appreciate the support. 
I want to do more videos like this. I've been a little lax in doing videos. So I've been busy with uh, the reselling business and um, had some computer issues. But hey, I'm um, I'm still here. I'm still looking for some fun treasures. And uh, if you guys like flea market videos and, and want to watch more, hit that bell button. I will be doing more. I will be selling at the flea market again before the summer's over. And um, have a great day. You want it, Ash? Yeah. Excuse me. I think I will get a good In the back, I'm a, I'm a wall. Thank you.